bridges can provide safe trips for people to cross from one place to another, usually on roads, rivers, valleys or in the mountains. The structure of the following bridges can be quite tense, but each of these bridges gives different sensations. Even a bridge that is arguably the safest or in most dense looks a little scary. A bridge can be dangerous for a variety of reasons, both because it is very old, narrow, too high and a variety of other reasons. Nevertheless, this bridge is used for various purposes as a lane or even the only way to cross. Here are some of the most tense bridges in the world. Number 5. Egg you it'll do midi. Located at the top of Agu Il Dumidi in the Montana Blanc Massif near Chamonix. This bridge has a height of 12,605 meters above sea level. When using this bridge, the most effective tips are don't look down. If you are interested in testing the Agu Il Dumidi bridge, visitors must take an electric car for 20 minutes. With the height of 3,842 meters above sea level, visitors are not only thrilled but at the same time witness the beauty of the steep and steep Alps. Agu Il Du Midi offers one of the most thrilling sensations and amazing scenery in the world. From the French resort town of Chamonix, visitors can reach this peak using a cable car where it can provide a 360-degree view of all regions of France, Switzerland, and Italy. One structure on the Agu Il Du Midi that stands out is a short bridge that runs between the two towers. Although the bridge is short, it provides a tense sensation on it. Adventurers also like this bridge. In 2013 a wingsuit trial was conducted, which was flying from a bridge. Because of the danger, tourists are unable to leave the visitor facilities on the Midi summit. However, mountaineers and skiers are able to pass through a tunnel to reach the steep and extremely exposed ice ridge to descend to the glacier below. In December 2013, a glass skywalk called Step Into the Void opened at the top of the Agu Il Du Midi peak. The view is 1,035 meters straight down, and one can see Montana Blank to the south. Number 4 Chesapeake Bay The Chesapeake Bay Bridge is a major dual-span bridge in the United States state of Maryland. This bridge is different than the others because it combines bridges and tunnels. The Chesapeake Bay Bridge is said to be the most terrible bridge in the United States. The 28.3-kilometer bridge has frightened many drivers in the United States. This bridge has a height of 350 feet or 106.68 meters. With such height it allows the ship to pass through it. Because of its height, this bridge caused some drivers to be scared. When the driver looks down, the drivers with a high phobia may not dare to pass. However, some claims say drivers who are not altitude phobia are also afraid when crossing the bridge. This bridge connects the east and west coast of Maryland. This bridge is scary because of frequent storms on this bridge and thick fog that blocks the eyes when driving on this bridge. The bridge was opened in 1952 and is among the top 10 most terrible bridges according to a travel magazine, Travel, and Leisure. The bridge is often the site of suicides by jumpers. 28.3 kilometers long, the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel has helped many people. Before there was a bridge, people had to drive 152 kilometers from Norfolk to Delaware Valley. However, since the bridge was inaugurated in 1964, you can save more time and energy. This bridge is in a 360-hectare park located in the city of Cannon, Colorado. Located 291 above the Arkansas River, this bridge was ranked as the highest bridge in the world from 1929 to 2003. 
It has a length of 384 meters and 5.5 meters wide and is equipped with 1,292 planks of wood making people who cross this bridge vomit when looking down. This bridge supports the road over the Royal Gorge. Decrease from the deck 955 meters to the ground below and this bridge is 938 feet long. It took six months to build it or between June 1929 and November 1929 and spent $350,000 to build this bridge. The fee is paid after the builder installs customs at the end. One thing most people don't know about this bridge is that this bridge was not built to facilitate transportation. It was intended to produce tourism. This bridge holds the record for being the highest in the world from 1929 to 2001 before the Liu Guang Bridge in China took that honor. Passenger vehicles are allowed to cross the bridge, but only before park attractions open or after they close, times depending on the season. Oversized vehicles, including large trucks, RVs and buses, are not permitted to cross. In June 2013, a wildfire destroyed most of the park's buildings in the aerial tram and damaged the incline. The bridge sustained only slight damage to the wooden deck and was otherwise undamaged, along with the sky coaster. 9. The park was rebuilt and partially reopened in August 2014. 13. The park had a grand reopening in May 2015 with new gondolas and a new zip line crossing the gorge on the east side of the bridge. Number 2 7 Mile Bridge Seven Mile Bridge is a bridge in the Florida Keys, in Monroe County, Florida, United States. It connects Knights Key in the Middle Keys to Little Duck Key in the Lower Keys. There are two bridges in this location. The modern bridge is open to vehicular traffic, the older one only to pedestrians and cyclists. The longest bridge in the Florida Keys is wide enough to give a motorist room to pull over to change a flat tire and steal many glances at the perfectly green water. Completed in 1912, the old structure, initially a railroad bridge, was known as the eighth wonder of the world because even attempting to build something so ambitious over miles of open water and a soft bottom in a harsh tropical climate seemed a bit naughty. The old Seven Mile Bridge, which extends parallel to the new one, is open for the hikers and bike riders. However, due to its gap, it ends without the possibility to reach its end. Every April, on a Saturday the new road is closed for 2,5 hours for a fun run. The marathon is held since 1982 to commemorate the rebuilding project. 1,500 runners participate in the challenge. The construction has won many awards, including an exceptional award for cost savings innovation. This bridge is actually not scary but because it is often lunged by the storm the bridge will be a frightening specter if it is passed during a storm. The bridge that stands now is a bridge that has been rebuilt before the original bridge did not allow the ship to pass under the bridge. Number 1 Sid River Bridge The Sid River Bridge is a suspension bridge about 1,222 meters long and about 496 meters high. The first part of the suspension cable installed, known as a cable pilot or pilot, was the first to be placed using a rocket. This bridge once held the top record as the highest bridge in the world, then followed by the Mila Viaduct Bridge in France. Sai Her River Bridge is a bridge that connects Shanghai with Chen, which crosses the Sidu River Valley near Yazangyu and in Badong, Qubai Province, People's Republic of China. The bridge spans a 500-meter deep valley of the Sidu River and superseded the Royal Gorge Bridge in the Beipan River Wangxing Highway Bridge as the highest bridge in the world until it, in turn, was surpassed by the Duge Bridge in 2016. Opened in 2009, the Sidu River Bridge beat out the previous record-holding span, the Hagejiu Gorge Pipeline Bridge in Papua New Guinea, which is suspended just over 1,200 feet above the ground. The Sidu Bridge was part of China's ever-expanding highway system, 
connecting two disparate parts of the country that were previously separated by difficult, mountainous terrain and multiple rivers. The bridge spans just over 5,000 feet across the river valley and was so far across that the builders had to use a rocket to string the first pilot line across the gap. The hefty length is supported by two massive, H-shaped towers, one at either end of the road, the suspension lines dip in the middle and rise back up again, looking more than a little flimsy for such a massive span.